Welcome back to Let's Play Bomberman Hero. Today we are entering Mazone. Welcome to Mazone. Most lazy name ever. <laughs> really? Ooh, a swamp. Hey, bud. <laughs> he seems a lot more flamboyant now that I've seen him again with the thong and the waving arms. <laughs> Jeez, I'm in a swamp! <laughs> he wants to pick some grass and berries. I mean, I can believe this. Guess who's here? <laughs> Uh-oh. I think I read that correctly. Pip, pip! Duck <laughs> oh buddy! My... Duck buddy! I can't believe... What blew my mind is that um, Peabot just said pip pip. <laughs> pip pip, come, cheerio. Come here, pip pip, what what, adjust monocle. I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> I hope you don't like adrenaline, because I love it. <laughs> Watch Jedders the Bridge to get that joke. <laughs> he seems a lot bigger this time around. I think that's what yeah. happens when you actually let him grow up. <laughs> that it makes sense to ride him and use him as a beast of burden. <laughs> but this is Louie. He's, I guess, a vehicle. He only shows up at two levels. He can uh, jump really high, jump on enemies to kill them instantly, and uh, jump off of walls. He's pretty much this version of Yoshi. Yeah. If he just can't eat anything. And you don't jump off of him when you get hurt. So he's better than Yoshi. Yeah. Take that. <laughs> eat shit. Fuck you. I'm just gonna kill it. <laughs> I eat shit with my feet! <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> and he does it with a smile on his face, apparently. I think I see a tongue. Nice that we have a new music beat, though. Yeah, you're gonna hear it a few times. <laughs> Grand. <laughs> Those are insanely creepy looking. Yeah. It's like someone attacked. They look kinda like puppets. I like can just imagine a giant hand behind them, behind that grass. The only reason I remember them is because playing through this game, they were the ones I always forgot. <laughs> and the ones that probably scared the shit out of you when you saw them. <laughs> I remember as a kid, I tried avoiding them. Until I realized they counted for points. <laughs> we like to burn them for points. <laughs> I love this grass laying technique, too. Yeah, that's the half-ass technique. Speaking of lazy planet. <laughs> we'll put grass here and here and screw it. <laughs> I got water, what do they want? You get the point, there's grass here. Those turtles are incredibly vulnerable. Yeah, they've got spikes on their heads and they've got shells. Put, just jump on them and they're gone. The shells, they do nothing! This cliff gives me so much crap. Look, thanks to no part to that turtle, look how much health he got for me in that transition. This is... The turtles, <laughs> we talk shit about him and then he does that. Good job, yeah. turtle. Yeah, he had the high ground. I'm not giving him any credit. This is... John Falls. John Falls. Yay. In the aptly named Mujon. <laughs> Mujon. <laughs> it was like, they were coming up with planet names, and then just one of the guys was eating pizza. <laughs> so what do we should call this planet? <laughs> what? <laughs> like Calzone? <laughs> you could find whatever. <laughs> just, just go with it. I heard Mazone. Yeah. <laughs> those guys apparently throw their hair, or their frill. Yeah, they're pretty worthless. Are they pants pulling up worthless? Uh, not quite. They do kind of attack you. Um, uh, aside from throwing their hair, they hip thrust at you. <laughs> Man, that feels like an attack to me. <laughs> it felt like one, too. Thankfully not in this recording, but plenty of playthroughs. One of the few attacks in this game where I might want to call the police. That enemy's placement is terrible. Mm. I got you! Oh yeah, there's another side in there. <laughs> This nothing just kind of recedes, like, once you hit him. More of those clouds. <laughs> I love the kamikaze style you sometimes adopt. <laughs> I gotta kill it! I swear, every time I get hit during these recordings, I'm just screaming in my head, I don't care! I don't care! <laughs> I think I just saw the hip-thrusting action. 
Yeah, you're gonna see a little bit more of it up close in a bit. But I think that, like those are one of the few enemies that can see you from a distance and will actually go after you. The fish? N not the fish, the hip thrust lizards. Do you just rain laser rain? Oh, no, wait, spikes. <laughs> yeah, it's spikes. <laughs> it's, not like, it's not like they just start running out of sound effects. It's like, you know what? Laser rain. That'd be so incredibly lazy, but I wouldn't put it past these guys. That sounds like an incredible band name, too. Laser rain! <laughs> I like when you hit those guys. They just kind of stand there trying to process everything. They get lost in thought. <laughs> Pump, huh? I thought that was going to work. <laughs> oh, my hair's on fire. Let me process what has just happened. Ow. <laughs> oh, Jesus. They, those big crazy looking faces. <laughs> That's the first time they've actually managed to attack me, I think. Uh, right in there was a ad hoc bomb, but I collected it. But then I had to re redo the level, so that's why it's not there. <laughs> why we show you? Because fuck it, we're going to. <laughs> why, is, why is this guy here? Because he's lonely. <laughs> that's why he's alone? Because he's lonely? Yep. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, lonely people don't always make sense. <laughs> But yeah, that, that's uh, the two exits for the level. Well, thank God they put the last exit so close to the beginning of the level. God. <laughs> no, that, no, Cocktease. God uh -huh. damn it. Did he, did, if, do you really want to keep seeing that same thing? I don't I'll, I'll tell you when it gets old. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, speaking of getting old, here's one of the worst levels in the game. And I'm not talking hard coaster where it's so slow and tedious, you wonder why they came up with it. It's so anti-fun, you don't know why they came up with it. It's supposed to be in a game. This is a genuinely terrible level. This is one of the levels that made me reconsider how much I like this game. <laughs> like, more so than you just making fun of the game. Actually playing this made me pretty much hate Bomberman Hero. It's pretty much all you're doing, it looks like, is just destroying ice cubes. Yeah, it's a completely pointless level. And it doesn't help that it's so obnoxious in general. Look, those ice things up at the top, you can see them. Uh, when you get close, they jump down at you for no reason, and they home in on you. So if you try and go under them, they'll just follow you, so you have to back up for no reason. It's ironic that a chunk of ice has been the most effective enemy thus far. <laughs> it really... and. It doesn't help that you have to be higher up to actually see them, but you have to be down below, like, so that they're cut off in the camera to actually collect any points. And then, of course, these jet streams are just a pain in the ass, because they'll push you away when you're not even close to them. And you're always trying to collect something right where the jet stream is. You know what's pushing you away? Those white round things. <laughs> Whatever those they, might be. They shoot salt. <laughs> oh no, That's... the snail powers activate! <laughs> Look at this. I wasn't anywhere close. And it's still pushing me away. This is about as fun as crunching on ice in a glass of water. I don't think I need to point out to viewers that this level has been sped up, but it's been for your convenience. In mine. Man, imagine having to sit through this level. Sorry, Thorn. <laughs> yes, please imagine <laughs> it. Pity me, please. <laughs> I, at this point, you're just like, oh, I gotta make it! <laughs> I was. I collected. I I remembered the maximum for this level because I hated it. I remembered as soon as I got the maximum, I'm just getting the fuck out of there. <laughs> but of course, we're not done with the area yet. Okay. I, <laughs> this, this is cool what? cave. It has the ice bombs and. Um. Okay! What might you be? <laughs> Carjack weasels, I guess. Look at my vertebrae! Why are they I, showing their spines? I don't. I don't. I. I really don't know what these things are. Bigger question: Where are they hiding the spine? <laughs> the, the point of this level is just collect ice bombs and use these guys as platforms. But. I, this level is. Th this game is so incredibly insane. 
every level, I find myself asking, who came up with this? The guy on the pizza high. <laughs> what am I gonna call this thing? <laughs> we stop eating pizza, Rick! <laughs> of course it was Rick. Of course it was. But Rick's the one that came up with all the boring stuff. Exactly! <laughs> this is the one that came up with the guy who was high, high on amphetamines or something. Yeah. Guy named Huey. <laughs> Huey the man high on amphetamines. <laughs> Get up! I wanna see- Get up! <laughs> I wanna see the behind the scenes of this team. Rick and Huey. Rick. That's an odd couple if there ever was one. <laughs> I smell a sitcom! <laughs> and they shoot lasers nonetheless. I smell a court order. <laughs> I love how they have their shows their feet walking, but they're not moving. That's how this this land is just full of evolution's faults. <laughs> it can only survive in these small areas because nothing can kill it, but that's about it. See it's walking! Speaking of evolution's faults, my sense of distance. <laughs> well you got it. <laughs> Finally. Ends just by the means, man. <laughs> the ends, of course, being viewers' entertainment at my expense. But of course. Now show me your spine. You're a vertebrae! Okay, good. <laughs> Funny thing is, they shoot lasers, but if you get them right as they're about to shoot them, the lasers will still shoot out, even though they're completely frozen. That makes sense. And apparently it doesn't melt the ice either. No. Super ice or something. And you're just incredibly soft and squishy. And yeah, for some reason, the, the ice melts if they just shake. Super ice, my ass. <laughs> Sad thing is, if they're, uh, I guess, unscrunched like that, uh, you can't get up anywhere. So you have to wait for them to shake out of their ice and uh, show their spine again. Come on, show me your spine. Too bad they don't shake like those stingrays did before. <laughs> Gotta get out of the ice, ah! <laughs> oh, damn. The one laser that hits me. No, you were right. The ones that hit me are always the ones that I could easily dodge. <laughs> That's what it seems like. A very random skill in this game. You make through an entire level not getting hit once, and then there's like, hey, something moving incredibly slow that you could dodge. Bam. <laughs> All right, whatever. Hang on, I gotta fly into it. <laughs> I haven't filled my quota for the level. Wait, not enough laughs, bam. <laughs> uh. And now more ice. More room. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you're, you're progressively through this Let's Play hating this game more and more. <laughs> like, look, this is good. This, this is okay. And this is not that great. <laughs> fuck this game. <laughs> See, fuck that level. Fuck this area. Fuck this planet. <laughs> Thank God there's Louie, because otherwise, fuck the planet. <laughs> no, Louie didn't die, though, so there weren't any last we could get out of it. Oh, come on. It's in a few. I, who do you think Peabot sh shoots? <laughs> <laughs> did you just have a brain collapse? I think I did. <laughs> because I, I think my mind just thought of both of them together and just went, ah! <laughs> Get a move on, Louie. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> right on, my mighty stallion. I can't get on you. Then you die. Well, that reminds me of that great piece of fan art. Hello there, princess. <laughs> I just wish it drawn up. Hello there. Princess. <laughs> Don't rape me! <laughs> I'm not even a prince. <laughs> it's not rape if you like it. <laughs> Peabot's a creepy motherfucker. <laughs> uh. And now you know why I asked you to commentate this with me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm here for, hoy! As if script writing Jether's a bridge to just coming up with birdie lines wasn't enough. <laughs> that <laughs> sold the entire let's play for me. <laughs> <laughs>
I don't know. <laughs> Why did that make me crack up of all things? I don't know. <laughs> I think along with early the <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'm just in a good mood today. <laughs> awesome. What happens if I fall asleep listening to Jesus and Mary Chain? Just inexplicable events. That's what happens. Uh, uh, my throat hurts. 